go ahead and check in with 23 ABC's Emma Lockhart. She's live on the bluffs experiencing this wind. Emma, what are you seeing? What are you feeling That's out right, there? That's right, Elena. You can see right now just how strong those winds are here on the bluffs. I've been here for about 20 minutes, and some of those wind gusts just so strong, almost knocking me over. And we are seeing those strong winds across the county, even stronger in our mountain communities. But take a look behind me. It just shows how dusty and how all of these weather conditions causing potential health concerns. So because of those strong winds, blowing dust and smoke from surrounding wildfires in the state, an air quality alert has been extended until 11 p.m. tomorrow night. Experts advising people to stay indoors. The particle pollution in the air right now can cause serious health problems. Blowing dust can make visibility hard on those roadways. Uh, there's also potential for flying debris. So you want to make sure you are driving with extra caution out there. Now those wind speeds, like Elena mentioned, are expected to die down later to late tonight. But that air quality alert will remain in effect through Halloween. So now, as you can see, I'm wearing that N95 mask that has a filter. Now, experts say if you are going to be going outside, which they advise against to wear one of these masks to protect you. Now, obviously, tomorrow is Halloween, so there's concern for everybody out there celebrating the holiday. So tune in tonight at 23 ABC News at 5 p.m. I'll have more details on these weather conditions and how you can keep yourself and your little ones celebrate and go out trick-or-treating tomorrow evening. Reporting live at the Bluffs, Emma Lockhart, 23 ABC, connecting you.